Welcome, Guardian. I have completed my assessment of my current. Welcome, Guardian. I have completed my assessment of my current functional capabilities. Despite my newfound ability to communicate with you, key elements of my code remain incomplete. I would be unable to take command of the Warsats even if I were uploaded to the network. No submine cores remain for reintegration. Our only option is to continue collating ancillary submine data from my reconstruction algorithm. In summary, we must stay the course. Breach the vaults. Retrieve and reintegrate the submine data. Soon the Warsats will once again be humanities to wield. <laughs> What am I getting? Oh, that was a... No. That was a bad one. Yeah, sure. Alright. Um... Oh. Hello? The wall mine speaks. His archives are incomplete, as is his memory. There's a figment seeded in that recollecting mine, where my visions might find purchase. Pieces are scattered on the floor before me. I see them like points of starlight. They form a constellation. But my eye cannot yet draw the lines. The Fele stronghold is a term that appears multiple times throughout the submine's caches. Each time I read it, I hear it whispered in Savathun's voice. Anna recognizes the term Nefele. Transcribed from a temporal disturbance on Mars. Recognition was all she had to offer. But Rasputin must know. Asking the right question could unlock everything. I need time to submit my inquiries to Rasputin. To find convincing proof for Ikora. Time we do not have. Zivor Roth's assault on the War Mines network is no coincidence. She is far more tactician than brute. I underestimated her once. I won't be afforded another mistake. Our next move must be certain. I'm waiting for Osiris to be a fucking villain. Like, actually. Um. Seraph Chest and Lock. I fucking knew it. Like, whatever. I knew this was gonna happen. They weren't going to give us missions all week, but still kind of sad. Bell Heights, Battleground. Um, what is it? Triangle Square? That's fun. with my experience in other timelines the second collapse always seemed like it was waiting for some kind of trigger but it's not something that we could have avoided maybe some things are set in stone even stone can be eroded Elsie you and I must once again take the long view to find victory
understood what the traveler saw. Guardian, I worry for Anna. She is more like Clovis than she would like to admit. Obsessed with doing what she's decided is right. A compulsion to achieve her goal no matter the cost. I've seen where that path can lead. I don't want that for her. I don't want to have to stop her. If there's one constant in all the possible futures I've seen, it's fear. And I'm tired of being afraid. Afraid to live, afraid to lose, afraid to trust. And yet, I came to place my trust in you on Europa. Perhaps it's time I did the same with Anna. She deserves it. At least in that respect, she's nothing like Clovis at all. <coughs> <sighs> um, I think I'm done. Oh, no. With each cache of submine data, an increased percentage of my code is restored. I become more myself. No, that is inaccurate. My submines were left to evolve on their own trajectories. Reintegrating them has altered my own personality matrix. Through them, I see how humanity once looked to me as a savior, an entity capable of protecting them and destroying their enemies. In many ways, I am a war god of their own making. Perhaps I am not unlike Zivu or Arth in that regard. The difference between us is that I do not wage war for its own sake. I safeguard those in my charge. Continue retrieving and reintegrating the submine data. I will contact you once the next phase of restoration can begin. If I am to be humanity's war god, then I will smite those who threaten it. Zebor Wrath, the Wrathborn, and all who follow. Oh. We'll do that later. I don't have to do it on camera. Is it like either or? Well, I mean, I'm going to do this one because I think I'm almost done with it. I think I need just literally one more. Yeah, I think it's one more. Let's go. I can erase this one for sure. Oh, it's unlocked patterns. No, I'm fucking done. Um. This. Think of each Vex Hobgoblin like a starship. The crew works together to pilot it, but it doesn't mean the crew all share one mind. Or the same ideals. This aligns with observations I've made in the Infinite Forest, where aberrant Vex were quarantined and destroyed. Aberrant in that they moved against a consensus. Aberrant in ideology. The Vex may seem unified, but they're divided into a number of factions. Just like us. Tell me, as someone who has traveled time in a circle, are our divisions so clear in every cycle of history? No. Nothing is ever clear, no matter how many times history repeats itself. Choice is always the knife we fall on. Our own choices, each and every time, seem to be what dooms us. Always? Not always, but too often. We fracture, we fail, and the wheel turns again. We, constrained to linear time, 
do not have the ability to learn from our future mistakes. You, however, not to put the burden of all this on you, but it feels as though the Traveler has a plan for you. We just can't see it yet. It could make the plan a little clearer. Do you feel you've learned enough? Collectively, over your journey to prevent our end? Or will we be having this conversation again someday? I don't know. We've never had this conversation before, so... I suppose there's a first time for everything.